The following video sequence shows the testing commissioned at HR Wallingford, which is globally recognised as one of the world's most advanced hydrological testing centres. HR Wallingford is also the British Standards Institution's preferred supplier of testing for PAS 1188-2 flood protection products. The series of rigorous tests included an extended static test over 24 hours, current tests at a flow of 1 metre a second, and wave tests at a depth of 790 millimetres and a wave height of 295 millimetres. Subsequently, these test conditions have been adopted by BSI as the conditions required for the British Standard PAS 1188-2. The system is modular and as such can be adapted to suit almost all applications where a transportable barrier is needed to contain or to hold back water or other liquids. Corner sections are readily available and can easily be added to the linear sections, providing a continuous barrier of any length. The testing had to take account of all the currently available historical flood data, the type of installation and the characteristics of the Rapid Dam flood barrier. The product currently being shown is the 1 metre high bolt down version. We also produce the freestanding version which requires no hard leading edge and a number of other variations which have different heights and functions. One of the many advantages of the Rapidam design is the reflection outwards of the wave action. This is a result of the angle of the back wall, which acts as a wave recurve wall. In effect, the wave recurve wall will fold the wave back into itself, reducing overtopping by as much as 75 to 80 percent. This can clearly be seen in the video, where you can see the waves are actually higher than the barrier. Since this footage was taken, we are happy to confirm that Rapidam has achieved the BSI Kite Mark license, publicly available specification number PAS 1188-2. Proof enough that the system can cope with the most rigorous of testing criteria. The Rapidam was exposed to three main tests, comprising dynamic wave action over a wide range of heights and frequencies and various water depths, as well as prolonged static testing. The total length of this barrier is 15 metres, with an approximate dry weight of 5 kilograms. Field tests already conducted show that on average it will take two individuals about 30 or 40 minutes to erect making it a very lightweight, quick, easy to install and obviously robust flood protection system. This following sequence shows part of the redundancy testing. The objective of this exercise was to test the Rapidam in the most severe conditions. 50% of the anchor positions, every other anchor position, were disconnected to simulate extreme damage to the system. The complete test series were run again. Rapidam's continued effectiveness can be clearly seen. From these tests, we can see that despite the fact that the waves are higher than the Rapidam, it is still effective. After three months of testing, there was still insignificant leakage past the barrier. Large areas of the ground underneath the barrier were free of water, having a dusty, dry appearance. Combine this with the fact that there was no damage whatsoever to the system clearly continues to demonstrate Rapidam's versatility and strength. Seeing 
really is believing.